Good day, kids. Do you know which one is more than the other? Do you know which one is less? Yan ang ating pag-uusapan today. In order to determine which one is more or which one is less, the following symbols are used. Less than, greater than, and equal sign. I repeat, less than, greater than, equal sign. Great Equalist Ako ang tutulong sa inyo upang madaman ang Mas maliit, mas malaki, o parang lang There are 10 sticks on the left And there is only one stick on the right So which one is more, which one is less Which symbol are we going to use? There you have it this is red as 10 is greater than 1. Can you repeat it? How about this one? Which symbol are we going to use to compare these two numbers? This is red as 1 is less than 10. Can you repeat it? Which symbol are we going to use on these two groups of sticks? There you have it. This is the equal sign. This is then read as 10 is equal to 10. Or it can be read as 10 equals 10. There you have it. We have learned about the three symbols. Let us try to use which symbol is more appropriate to compare two numbers. Let's compare 100 and 200. Which symbol are we going to use? 100 is less than 200. Let's continue comparing. 30 is greater than 20. How about this one? The one on the left is the same as the one on the right. Which symbol are we going to use? This is read as 11 is equal to 11 or 11 equals 11. 4 is greater than 1. 2 is equal to 2. 2 is less than 3. Now let us try to use these symbols with money. The following are the Philippine peso coins. Let's compare their values using these symbols. Can you guess which of the three symbols we are going to use? Let us read 100 pesos is greater than 16 pesos. How about this one? Ten pesos is less than one hundred pesos. How about this one? Ten centavos is greater than five centavos. How about this one?
25 pesos is greater than 25 centavos. How about this one? Ten pesos is greater than five centavos. How about this one? Five pesos is greater than one peso. How about this one? Ten pesos is greater than five pesos. How about this one? Ten pesos is equal to ten pesos. How about this one? Ten pesos is less than fifteen pesos. How about this one? Five hundred pesos is less than five hundred and five centavos. How about this one? One hundred pesos is equal to one hundred pesos. How about this one? One hundred ten pesos is greater than one hundred pesos. How about this one? One thousand and twenty five centavos is greater than one thousand and five centavos. How about this one? One thousand ten pesos is greater than one thousand five pesos. How about this one? Fifty pesos is equal to fifty pesos. How about this one? Fifty pesos is equal to fifty pesos. How about this one? Fifteen pesos is less than one hundred pesos. How about this one? Two hundred pesos is greater than sixteen pesos. How about this one?
35 pesos is less than 200 pesos. How about this one? Twenty pesos is less than thirty pesos. How about this one? Twenty pesos is less than twenty five pesos. Now it's your turn to compare two groups of money. Congratulations! Now let us wait for your teacher to discuss these items. This project is brought to you by iVolunteer for Filipino children. Just remember, this is my personal advocacy and it is free. Anyone may join.